coming to you from Dark Ronin Film Studios, sponsored by Penn State York, it's The Beat at Five. Now, here's Jones. Hey guys, welcome back to Feed at Five with your hashtag of the day, tweets you may have missed, and the best way to end the week. I'm Jones, let's feed. First up, Vanity Fair tweets, six hotels in Rome that guarantee an unconventional stay. So we finally know where the saying, when in Rome, came from. Admittedly creepy picture though. Megan Trainer tweets when a paparazzi poses for you. Too funny. She's always putting a positive spin on things. Where most celebs would complain about the paparazzi, Megan plays along. Hashtag refreshing. TechCrunch has 15 new hidden features tucked away in iOS 9. For the 15 people with the 16 gigabyte iPhones who actually have enough space to download it. I wasn't one of them. Fortunately, if you use iTunes and a cable to your phone, you can still update. Pro tip. USA Today tweets, 35% agree that US Constitution establishes a Christian nation. So we know what percent paid attention in history class. Polls try to make everything so simple, and yet they always leave more questions than answers. Like, who are the 5% that answered, I don't know? Aaron Griffith tweets, Pinterest hits 100 million users. I guess these days there's a lot to be interested in. Ah, uh, 100 million seems to be the magic number that says you've made a name for yourself. Speaking of social media, Wired tweets that Facebook wants to lure journalists away from Twitter. And that is why this isn't the original Facebook show. There's just more news here. And last, Larry King tweets, I got my flu shot today. They're available now and it's important to get yours. Advertisement or is this his secret to living a long and healthy life? Alrighty, bro, that's our show. Thanks for stopping on by. Until next week, I'm Jones. Stay loud.